make his 10th start in place of Montana. Don Shula in a golf cart after surgery on a torn Achilles heel. Third quarter, tied at 14. Dolphins moving the football. Marino to Aaron Craver. Then we try the running game. Bernie Parmalee off the right side. Keeps his balance and bangs down to the four-yard line. The very next play, Marino rolling right. He never runs with the football. Dan dives in for the score. Only his eighth rushing touchdown of his career. Didn't even want the ball. Probably didn't want the fine either. Chiefs trying to answer. Steve Bono looking for Willie Davis. But Gene Atkins steps in front and picks it off. Runs for a while. When he runs out of real estate, laterals to Troy Vincent. And Vincent takes out a referee and then goes in for the touchdown. Officially 76 yards on the play, but with all the east-west, probably more like 100 yards. On the ensuing kickoff, the Dolphins kick it off, and John Vaughn finds a hole and breaks it. The former Patriot, the former Seahawk, the current Chief, goes 91 yards for the touchdown. That would put the Chiefs down only seven, down 28-21. Shula in a golf cart in a tight football game. That was until Bernie Parmalee would explode through a hole. 47 yards for the touchdown, his second of the game, running the Dolphins into the playoffs. They win 45-28. Parmalee rushed for 127 yards, had to leave early, though, with a right knee sprain. Miami can clinch the AFC East with a victory in one of its two final games. Against